ADCC trials coming up. How's the camp been going out here? Camp has been great. We're slowly building to a peak. We've been sort of changing up the dynamic of the rounds, less situation, more sort of tailored to just open, open situations, uh, shorter time, so like a six minutes. It's less of a cardio thing and more of a dog. You know, a lot of people don't have that dog in them. I'm doing 88. I should be doing 77, but I'll do 88. You can cut to 77 pretty easy, right? Yeah, super easy. Day's gonna get fucking wrecked, bro. <laughs> I don't even think he'll make it to day two this time, to be honest. I'm the truth speaker, you know? I say what everyone's thinking. It's gonna be a good weekend. I feel pretty excited, very nervous, but that's normal. It means you care. Look at this guy. I'm, a, I'm, I'm trying to be a proper 77. I'm still a little bit light for the division. Last West Coast Trials, um, I took bronze. I am transitioning out to professional MMA, so this is kind of like my last ADCC trial to try to punch my ticket. Yeah, everyone's looking really sharp. There's some guys in the room that like, I think a lot of people haven't really heard of that are gonna, I think, start to make a pretty big splash uh, at Trials. Well, obviously we got Damien, uh, we got Pale, we got Kieran. Fucking Commonwealth outnumbering the Yanks now. Uh, but the, the lesser known guys, for example, uh, Nick Mattia, Roman. Monkey never cramp. These guys are 77 and 66. I think they're sort of like unsuspecting and uh, they're gonna surprise some people. So. What's up guys, my name is uh, Pierre Leclerc and I'm uh, gonna compete at the ADCC West Coast Trials in uh, the 77 kg division. Uh, my name is Chris Bojic. Uh, I'm gonna be competing in the 88 kilogram division at the ADCC West Coast Trials. Saw so, dudes, my name is Roman. Corona. I'm going to compete at the ADCC West Coast Trials in the 66 kilogram division. My name is Joshua Weiland. I'm going to be competing in the 66 kg bracket out in West Coast Trials in Vegas. All right, so for this trial, guys, I'm going to be representing B Team once more uh, and TriStar Gym. And uh, being part of this trials is like, especially West Coast Trials, is like the best thing. You know, it's like it's the last one for North America. It's the toughest one, and it's the most exciting one as well because the divisions are so deep. I'll be representing uh, B Team and uh, my friends back home at Seraphim Jiu Jitsu in Chicago. Representing B Team, it's a big step up from where I was two years ago. So two years ago, I was representing uh, my, my gym back home, and I came into the West Coast trial was like relatively unheard of and I kind of surprised a lot of people and so uh, representing B team now I know that there's gonna be a little bit more kind of pressure on me a little bit more uh, you know, people looking out for me in the bracket as opposed to before and man honestly there is no other team like this just the grit the love you know the confidence these guys give you it's crazy I, I love this room this is this is the room to be in you know ever since I've gotten the B team these guys have treated me like family They've given me so many opportunities to travel the world, travel the country, compete with the team. You know, whenever I'm out there competing for B team, I feel like I can't let them down, you know, because they've given me so much. So I kind of want to give something back to them by winning and representing the team pretty well. Thank you very much for watching. Please like the video, leave a comment, subscribe, share it, do what you gotta do. We're entertaining, we're giving our heart and soul to you on these mats. So let us know what you think and uh, thanks for watching.
I really think, honestly, I think podium for 77. So obviously, it's going to be tough. It's the toughest weight class to win. Podium for 77. It's, it's got to be Mattia and Kieran. Like, those guys are very high level. It's going to be, I'm very excited to watch them uh, perform. Yeah, so he's literally my hardest round uh, since Nick, Nick and Ryan won't train with me. Wait, 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 wait. He won't train with me. He trained with you last week. Yeah, not even. It was like less than a week ago. And then I invited him to come train with me two. last night. Because you missed noon session. Yeah, I, I can still put in the work. Me and Adam, Adam Bradley got three rounds in yesterday. What do you think about uh, like our guys going into trials in the next couple weeks? Dude, it's it's gonna be sick, man. I'm uh, I'm really excited for 77 with Kieran and Nick Mataya. I think Mataya can take out some some really big names. I think people are gonna be surprised. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's definitely he's definitely still has some some holes in his game that you know he needs to work on. But I mean, the guy has a full time job. Is still here every day, scrapping. Like he'll do a round with me, straight to Jay, straight to Ben Hodge, right back to Jay. Um, but like, yeah, he's a hard worker. He learns super quick. So I think if he wants to pursue it, he can legitimately be one of the best in the world. Training's been really hard. Um, every time I'm, you know, whenever I'm in town, I'm here every single day and you know, training with the best guys, Jay and Ethan and everybody, um, and doing a lot of wrestling. Uh, this camp has been going really well. I feel like I didn't prepare as well for East Coast Trials as I have been for the West Coast Trials, so I'm really excited to go out there and check it out. Camp has been long, honestly. It's been grueling. There's been some injuries in it, but we're still here. We're feeling good. We're closing in, so now we're just working on some more tactical, uh, strategic aspects of my game. East Coast Trials, I didn't cut any weight. I actually weighed in six pounds underweight, so I was really small for the bracket. So for uh, this camp, the biggest change was I'm dropping down to 66, down to 145. So that's the biggest change. Everything else has kind of been kind of the same. Just training hard, training with the best guys in the room, and really sharpening my game, make sure I can implement my game before anyone else can. I mean, Kieran, you know, he's been kind of breaking out over the past few years. Uh, he's beaten some big names, and uh, I think Kieran can do very well too. Um, his wrestling's getting a lot better. You know, he's been focusing on his wrestling a lot this camp. Um, so I think he's gonna kill this one. How long proper stack? LMNT and honey. <laughs> the headstand defense. I feel obviously better than ever. I got such amazing resources here and uh, to kind of fill gaps in my game. So I think you're gonna see a little bit, a little bit more of a guard play from me, but I'm gonna be really confident also wrestling in the overtime rounds thanks to the guys that I have around here. This is definitely the highest level room I've ever got to train in, so I'm feeling super duper ready. So uh, yeah, so far like it's, I think it's gonna be my fourth trials or something. I, I've been uh, lucky and skillful enough, I guess, to make it to the second day. And my goal right now is like once again make it to the second day and try to crack that top top eight, you know, and and, and win trials. I'm obviously there, there to win. It's just getting harder and harder. But uh, I feel I feel good with my my skill level right now. So hopefully we get to uh, those deep deep rounds on the second day. That's that's the goal right there. So this is going to be my fourth uh, North American Trials. Uh, I did it first back in 2021 and I lost in the second round. Um, and then at the last West Coast Trials, I uh, took uh, fourth place at 77 kg. And then in the last East Coast Trials, I uh, lost in the round of 16 at uh, 77 kg. So now going into a new weight class, going up. Um, and so that's going to be, I think, a big change for me. Yeah, so this is my first Trials actually. So. We're going, we're, we're going to win, you know, if you're not going to win, why are you going? But we're taking everything as a learning experience as well, so let's go. Last trials I did was East Coast. Like I mentioned before, I went up a weight class, I didn't really cut any weight. I uh, lost to a teammate, Officer Grammy, out in Wilson Bros. Gym, fuck you. <laughs> um, but, you know, if I was going to lose against anyone, it's going to be another stud who's a B-team guy. 
you know, that was my first trials I ever did. I'm used to losing. I'm used to not, you know, not making it to the finals and coming back and making it to the finals next time. So I believe this trials, I can uh, definitely make the podium, sure. You had you know one of the craziest matches last West Coast Trials against uh, Andrew Tackett. Yeah, uh, dude. Talk about that match. That match was insane. I mean, Andrew, uh, he's already you know he's known to be a scrapper. All right, that guy just doesn't stop moving, and he had cut weight because he didn't want to be in 77 with Cody Steele and his brother William Tackett, so he cut weight to 66. So I had to face him and ended up going into overtime. It was just an insane match. Um, I ended up winning a, a slim decision. It was like, it was, it could have gone either way. I'm planning matches against the Corbet brothers. Uh, Dominic, obviously, from New Wave is going to be a big one. Keith Krikorian is always going to be a name that's going to be out there. Then there's some other guys from, uh, um, like, lower... I don't really remember their names, but I remember watching them in trials and saying, like, oh, okay, so I just got to make sure that I game plan around those, those guys. So this is going to be my first time doing 88 in a North American Trials, and so my goal is to kind of just prove that I belong in that division, that I, you know, I want to have matches with the best guys in the bracket, you know. Um, so that's really my goal, is just to prove that I belong both at 77 and 88 as one of the top contenders. Yeah, I'm hoping to get some sick wins in, some good submissions, some big slams, you know. But more than anything, my goal is just to be able to showcase my jiu-jitsu, show, show everything I got, you know, leave nothing to the refs, fuck them, get shit done. I really just plan to showcase my pace. I shot out Dorian. I want to do like a Dorian uh, style where I'm just kind of fucking on him. Yeah, I'm hoping that I just get more submissions. Like, uh, I obviously I, I love winning, but I I prefer winning by submission. So, like, if I can get to those like things I've been working on in the last year, like uh, a lot of different new tools uh, that I can like surprise people with. Yeah, just a full package, pretty much. I was able to beat a black belt world champion out in Kazakhstan just with my pace and, re and uh, being relentless. So I plan to implement that same type of style, maybe to sprinkle a little bit more jujitsu this go around. <laughs>